Ok, so welcome to this tutorial on Solana the apps of the Solana ecosystem. In this tutorial, we're going to see Solsi. So we're going to see what is Solsi, why NFTs, how to create your own NFTs and collections, how to verify your NFTs on Solsi, how to sell more NFTs using our token and the strategy for selling NFTs, not a financial advice, and RTFM. So let's start. So what is Solsi? Solsi is an open NFT marketplace in which you can create or mint NFTs. It has low fees because it's built up on Solana and the NFTs come with embedded licenses. Also calculates the rarity rank for collections and you can pay using, for example, MoonPay or FTX Pay. Okay, so let's see an overview of Solsi. So you come to solsi.io and you click on connect wallet. And you connect your wallet. Then you log in. And now you are logged in. So what can you do? For example, you can explore NFTs. So there are three types of listings. The gold listing that you, when you have your wallet and you go to your NFTs in my wallet, when you list, you can stake some R token. R token is the official token of SolC. So when you click on list, you can add, add some art and it will be gold listed. But you need to be first in Radium, in Orca, or in Gate. So the primary listing is gold. You can also be listed in SolC if the if the NFT was minted here. Also, the status of NFT can be verified. This is verified. Or can, can be, for example, unverified. So let's see, for example, one unverified. All these are verified. This is like a special listing. And we see that all are verified. So for example, all these NFTs are verified. If you don't see the, this check mark, is that the NFT is not verified. And also, you can see the activity that are the latest NFTs sold out. So you can see this was the lastest sold of NFT. Also, a very useful tool is to go to explore stats. And you can check, for example, the top sellers collection in the last 24 hours. Or you can change the range. So, for example, the last 24 hours, this collection has sold uh, 75 sold, $4,000. And you can see all here, all the collections that have sold. Also, you can explore collections. So, for example, let's search for my collection. And here you find the collection. The collection is verified. And you can see there are listed 209 NFTs. The floor price is 0 0.06. This means that the NFT that is cheaper in this collection and is listed is listed for 0 0.06 sold. So if you sort by and you sort for a small price to higher price, you can see that this NFT is listed at 0 0.06. You can also, for example, filter for created at, and you can see the for example here the latest created perfect and you can see here the website of the project the twitter the discord and you can also check for unverify or verify or if they are minted in solsi or they are or they are not minted in solsi and the volume that is the total sales of this nft collection in all time Okay, so why NFTs? What are some uses of NFTs? You can use it for funding your startup or centralized autonomous organization. You can use it for real estate, for medical records, identity verification, intellectual property, for creating your academy, for special member access in website and apps, for supply chain, game industry, and tickets. So how to mint? There are three ways to mint. You can use Candy Machine. So you need to download the GitHub and it's using Metaplex. This company created the Candy Machine and you can download and in your website, the, the users paste 
the minting price and they click on mint. You also can mint in Solsi that we're going to see how to mint in Solsi and you can also mint using Metaplex and Arweave with custom code. Okay, so let's create an NFT. The first thing is to go to create NFT and you click on upload preview and here we get our NFT image and our artwork. So next, the title. The description. Only 64 characters maximum and here Then the royalties, for example, 5% for secondary sales. You will receive if someone buys, and then here is sales, you get you get 5%. The external URL, here you put your URL of the project. Then the tax, for example, it can be in metaverse. The license is public, the owner, the holder can show in their social media, but they cannot use for commercial exploitation. The collection is a punks and the trades, for example, let's set the eyes to glow and status go. And you click on mint. And you sign up the transaction. Also, to say the recommended process is to uh, mint in your website using uh, Candy Machine or your own code, and then verifying the collection in Solsi and in Magic Eden, and people can resale. You can make very very cheap minting prices, so people can benefit and they can resell. So now we are uh, approving the transaction for minting. And if everything is okay, we should see this NFT in our wallet, but it is not verified. We need to verify before selling. So we are waiting the mint transaction. So we wait for the mint transaction, almost done. Cross fingers. Great. It's already minted, so we can see the mint. And here you can see our mint in our wallet. The collection is verified, but this NFT is not verified. Okay, so how to verify your NFTs in Solsi and why you need to verify? You need at least 1,000 Twitter followers and a proof of authorship. So if we go to my profile, collection verification, you can select your project and you need to add here a link i'm not showing but you need to add a link for proof of authorship so you need to upload how do you create your nfts the drawings the 2d the 3d software in use also if you use candy machine you can upload all your nfts hash list with as an array and here the mint the mint and comma and then the other one, something like that. You can get all your mint addresses and the candy machine ID or IDs. And here you can add the Twitter to handle. The Twitter must have 1000 followers. Okay, so why verify? Because you will increase your sales and you will give trust. Okay, so buying art. Art token helps you in gold listing. So this is the official token of the Solsi project. And if you have, you can gold list and you can save on fees. You can earn more sol. So it's a token with a real utility usage. So a strategy for selling NFTs. You need to create a real utility token. Create a white paper and a roadmap. Build a community on Twitter, on Discord. Be very active. 
Another idea is to share revenue with holders and create strong tokenomics. So, hope you like this tutorial and this inspired you to create your DApp.